Hi, my name is Nate Collins, and I have the privilege of serving as the president and founder of Revoice. I'd just like to take this opportunity to invite you to our 2023 conference where the theme will be Made for Love. It feels really good to be here with you guys. We're gonna have a great time worshiping together. We're gonna have a great time growing together. I will be crying, so maybe we'll be crying together. We often talk about Revoice as a sort of like big family reunion, but we wanna help you connect with people who have shared experiences because we recognize that even in our community, there's a lot of diversity. We need a safe space for those of us who love Jesus, but are also gay Christians. I'm among people who understand me. I don't have to tone down parts of me. I don't have to worry about being misunderstood. This is community, that together we are the strongest. And if one were to walk away, they're a target, they're vulnerable. Together we are stronger. Revoice really allows a community of people to come together and share unique bonds in ways that we don't necessarily have now, either home churches or environmental spaces. So definitely a way to get taught and fed spiritually and nourished, so I love that. We love Revoice for one reason, because it brings together a part of the body of Christ that seems to be missing from our normal experience of church. It is about connection and community. It really offers Sleepy Christians a place where they feel like they can belong and they can just worship God, fellowship, without fear. I think it's a safe place to process things. So you don't have to have everything figured out. Like just show up. The talks, I feel like, do a great job starting from like, what is the gospel and who is Jesus and building up to like, what does it really look like to flourish in the church and even like send you out to like, what does it look like to be a, a difference maker, a change maker in your church and community? Yes, remember that Jesus knows what you're going through and experiencing. These are truly awful things and they're far too common for all of us. Know that you are a queer and priceless treasure and that you shine. You shine because God made you to shine. I wish people knew that the most exciting thing about Revoice is not that we talk about being gay. It's that we can acknowledge the reality of our experiences of sexuality while we talk about our love for Jesus. And to hear similar stories as my own and not having to explain myself, over explain myself, to be trusted, to hear vulnerability. It's just such a beautiful space. There's no fear, it's just family. I would say just come, I promise you. You won't regret it. It will be life-changing, especially if it's your first time. You will feel parts of you that have felt unknown. Just be like, oh, I get it. Because I remember the first year I walked in, I immediately started crying because it's like, everybody in this room gets it. You don't have to explain who you are, how you exist. You don't have to fight to be validated because everybody just simply being at your voice validates your existence.